I'm Dominique Lavignier, your Bakersfield neighborhood reporter, and I'm outside the Iron Lily special events venue, which will host the Got the Dot program's annual fundraiser, Grillin' and Bruin. And this year is different from the rest. I want to be involved with JJ's legacy because um, my dad has a kidney failure, and like he's part of the um, he's part of the foundation. So I just wanted to help join and support. Evan Bone's dad is one of more than 88,000 people waiting on a kidney donation the most sought after organ donation across the country. I just want to help spread awareness about organ donation so like other people that might have parents that are going through what I'm going through, like they might have a better chance of getting an organ. 33 students from high schools all over Kern County, like Frontier High Junior Carter Beardsley, holds booths, educational seminars, and promotes the cause on social media to educate people about organ donation. Getting the dot on your driver's license is a life-saving opportunity. You never know when an opportunity could arise that you could be a donor and save someone's life. And now they will take the lead on running the program, coordinating in various committees to make their annual fundraisers happen. It's important to teach them and, and let them lead because the last two years we did it all. Malgan believes the Got the Dot Club will help teach the students leadership qualities to continue impacting the community. We have some really great superstars in our community that will be our leaders one day. According to the Health Resources and Services Administration, 90% of Americans support organ donation, but only 60% of people are registered to donate. That's why the students continue to encourage others to donate. It just feels cool having an impact on people. You can attend the annual Grillin' and Bruin event on November 9th at 5 p.m. For 23ABC News, I'm Dominique Lavignier, your Bakersfield neighborhood reporter.